Y'all here? Well, we're going to start today's sermon. Ladies and gentlemen, what is the state of levity today? What exactly do I mean by levity? Bliss, joy, enthusiasm. <laughs> Jesus, Buddha, Allah, Yahweh, yeah. All those guys were relaxing all the time. They were mellow in their skins, weren't they? Amen. Uh, <clears throat> well, maybe those guys were a bit uptight, which begs the question, why is it that we have so little levity today? My friends, we are in a downright drought of delight. <laughs> And this is why I have called you together. This is the all hands fire drill meeting of the Levity League. <laughs> so let's have at it, folks. Who is affecting all this nightly levity lifting? Yes, yes, Ralph, there in the front row. You, what are you saying? Bad news, it's a stream of bad news. Well then, crew, the bad news gets uh, the levity a flowing, so to whom is it a going? What's that, Fiona? Flailing furiously in the back row? Fox News! Fox News, she says. Well then, sounds to me like you've nabbed one of the members of the anxiety division. <laughs> so where have our friends at Fox News stashed all the levity loot? <laughs> the whole league is rising up in unison, buried in the ground, you say. What's that person off to the left, little interloper? Beside Amy Goodman's stash, you say. <gasps> Are you from stage left or stage right? Well then, friends, how about them foxies and them lefties water all that stolen seed and grow us a great garden of joy? Sign us up! Sign us up! Y'all are shouting. Sign us up! Revivify our missing bliss. <laughs> Let the talking heads of reactionary radio blossom into the fountain heads of positivity. <laughs> so, dearest minions of the League, how do we carry this plan out this day? Give them drugs, you say. Roll them a fat one. <laughs> well, that might just do the trick, but no, dear friends, there is a better way. Laugh. Laugh at yourselves first, of course, then laugh at them. And they won't be able to hold it in. And when they crack a grin, it will break the strangleholds of their conceits, and they will bust right out of the absurdity of it all. For we are all just existing on this ball, and in something less than a century, we will all take a fall. A fall, a fall, a fall. Oh dear. Well, Lee, you've got me in a downer now. <laughs> yes, Freddie, even your fearless leader is subject to the occasional misleader dis depressions. Well, I have to come clean with you now. I have to confess. So this is my confessional. You see, when I was born, I was given up. And I was put into a crib all by myself, never saw anyone. Uh, but when then I woke up, and I behold the greatest fright of my life. And what could that have been? That was a black-eyed baby sitting right next to me, in the next crib or in mine, I don't remember. And those eyes were penetrating. Those eyes went right through me, and I looked away. And then years later, I thought, I got it all wrong. That baby wasn't attacking me. That baby was looking at me, saying, who are you? What am I? And where are we going? 
So I had this revelation. The revelation was, I can't look in people's eyes. So how can the minister of bliss, who can't make a connection with his nearest and dear, dearly beloved league members, profess the laws of leg levity? So with that confessional, dear league, I took myself off to my friend Sasha, uh, who is an old man. He's an old Russian man. He's old and he's dying, and he's blind. And I took, him off, took myself off to see Sasha. And this is what I found. So here we have Sasha. And when, when you look into Sasha's eyes, and you see the joy on his face, it is a thing to behold. It is like gold. Can you all see it? It is like gold. So I sat next to Sasha, and I said to him, how can this be? You're almost departed. How can you be in the state of bliss? And he said to me, I worked all my life to get here. I moved my spirit every day so that when I was in this state, I would be in this state. So I thought, my goodness, this is vision. This is wisdom. So I took my chance, my one chance, and held Sasha's hand. His warm hand in mine, I looked into the deep blue of sightless eyes, and you can't imagine how deep this is. And there I was seeing in the pool of his being, all of the liquid lost levity. It had been found. So dear league, the levity has been found. If you want some, and Sasha told me, take as much as you can possibly get out, take it in, it's all for free. Then what you must do is find another, an old person, a young person, a lefty, a righty, and look deep into their eyes and take without questioning and give without thinking. And dear League, this is how we will remake the world, how we will remake the world.